Like not us, man. Sounds too fishy to me. No, not you two. Since the vampire went after the Hex girls before... But those girls are too scared. We can't put them at risk again. Yeah, you're right, Velma. We just need someone to look like one of them. My mother would have a heart attack. Why does she get to wear the dress? Because Shaggy doesn't have the hips for it. Uh, okay, Velma, start singing. Uh, almost wet, but I fled, almost wet, but I fled, almost wet, but I fled. Yeah, yeah. worked? Well, what part of foolproof didn't you understand? Like, I don't think now's the time for a makeover, Dad. There's always time for a makeover, especially when it's also an unmasking. Who is that? Now, why would a cutie like you want to ruin our video? Frustrated singer? Actor? Trick-or-treater? I don't have to tell you anything. Then allow me to fill in the blanks. I am Owen de Castle, and this is Steve Fortescu. I bought this place from Stephen's parents, distant descendants of reputed vampire Baron Fortescu. You mean you stole my family's pride, stomped on our souls, and now you're profiting off my legacy? As you can see, the boy has some issues. Now I will leave my castle to take him to the village where the authorities can deal with him. Uh, Mr. de Castle? We just came that way. Sorry, but the bridge is out and the roads are all flooded. Then we're stuck here all night with that freaky Fortescu kid? I know a very safe place to keep him out of trouble. This is a safe place? <laughs> like I'm feeling a lot of things right now and safe is not one of them. <laughs> can lock me up, but that won't make a difference, old man. Your problems won't end with me. You want the real vampire. <laughs> but I don't want the real vampire. I want to go back upstairs. And you will, as soon as I take care of one more thing. <sighs> you talked, master? Yeah. Richfield. Why don't you show these nice people to their room? 